Hello everybody, Flaming Young here. Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask. We're in the bomb shop, I guess? I don't remember why I was in here. Hmm. Well, anyway, on today's episode, we are actually going to start by playing the song of double time. I plan on doing a certain side quest this episode, which is the Oceanside Spider House. Remember just a bit ago, we did the um, Swamp Spider House. This is basically the same thing, except you have to do on the first day. Remember that. Um, that is if you're playing the version I am. If you're playing the version I am, you have to do it first day. If not, then I don't think it matters. Um, you also want to... I want to make time normal again, so that way we don't have to wait, because we're going to have to wait anyway. I don't really have a choice. We're going to be resetting time fairly shortly. Because, like I said, for the thing that we want to do, it has to be during the first day. But we're going to start off by doing something pretty easy. We could have done this earlier if I really wanted to. But I didn't really want to, alright. Um, also, I was sort of looking into stuff to do, and I saw the Bomber's Notebook. There's a bunch of stuff here. Well, it turns out that one of the things is actually something we've already done. So I'm hoping that if we just talk to that person, like, again, I think we actually go through here. Yeah, we can, indeed. I'm hoping that if we just talk to this person, hasn't showed up yet, kind of stinks. I'm just, I'm really hoping, mostly, that it will spawn and I won't have to do it again. Because one of the things in the notebook is that hand dude, and we did it before we got the notebook. So I don't know if it will count, even though we already got his heart piece, like we already did the thing. I don't know if it will count in the bomber's notebook though. But I do want to complete the bomber's notebook because it's part of 100%. And we have all these first three are all part of the Anjun Cafe side quest. We'll be completing this dude today. That's what we're actually waiting for right now. Same with this guy. Um, and we'll also finish the postman in the side quest. As well as her. And him after the side quest is over. So most of these people all have to do with the side quest. I don't actually know what those two people are. Oh, one of them is the hand, I think. The other one I'm not quite sure, to be honest. To be perfectly honest. I'll figure that out when I need to actually know. So I believe we're waiting until 10 o'clock? When does this open? So you need the Romani mask, by the way, to do this. You need Romani mask, Zora mask, Gora mask, and Dyke the mask. Those are the, all the masks that you will need. So we're just waiting, basically. Um, <laughs> I was gonna say I would cut, but like, there's really no point to it. I guess I can grab a hundred rupees. There's a lot of stuff to do in the Angel Cafe side quest, and I remember last episode at the end, I said that I'm not sure if we can do it yet or not. Turns out we indeed can do it. 
So we're going to be doing that before the Great Bay Temple, just because we're going to get a good amount of things from it. Like, a lot. But you see all the masks that we have left? All the masks here? We're going to get, I think, all of them but one. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I, I think so. I don't know, actually. I'm starting to doubt myself. I probably should have just started the video. Alright, yeah, open from 10pm. So we have to wait until 10pm. It's almost 10pm. This part's kind of cool. Boom. Ah, you were a member. Please come in. I'm a member. I showed so with my cow head. And apparently Gorman is also a member. So... We're gonna go up on the stage. And... Oh, maybe we have to talk to this dude first. All right. On the right. Okay, play your guitar like this. Pretty cool. If you don't remember, Toto is actually a Zora, and he's the manager of the Indiegogos, which is the band that Macau's part of. Apparently he doesn't recognize us. What feels good, that wretched senseless racket? Hmm, huh, funny. And uh, now we'll take this off. Okay, you play the ocarina, right? Stand in the center. Sounds good to me. Play ocarina like this. what I'm doing. And he's gonna say the same thing every time. Now nah, we're a Deku man. And I think we can just see target him. Yep. Front left spotlight. Okay, now play your pipes like this. <laughs> down, down, down. That's gonna sound pretty cool when they add them all up, so I'm gonna turn the sound up a little. It's funny that they give the biggest guy the uh, smallest spotlight. Bravo, that was the best. That melody. That melody, it brings back so many memories. It's their old standby, Ballad of the Windfish. That's the song that members of the previous generation of the Indiegogos made famous. I entered show business because I heard this song at Carnival of Time Long Ago. By doing performances, I thought maybe I'd get to see the singers of that song. The one you heard singing must have been the original Lulu. Mother of the current lead singer, who's also named Lulu. So her daughter is singing now. Is that so? I'd like to hear that. 
I'm sorry I booed you. Please take my mask. You got the circus leader's mask. So sad it could put a tear in even a demon's eye. So remember how I said the mask of scent was the most useless mask in the game? Well, guess what? It just so happens there's a mask even more useless than that one. And yeah, guess which one it is? The Gorman Troop Leader's Mask. You know why it's useless? Because it's a use is to help you with something that you had to already do to get it. That's right. It, when you do the thing with Kremia to get the um, mask of the Romani mask, it um, makes it so that the Gorman brothers don't attack you. Because they're all brothers. There's a side quest in the 3DS version that I would like to cover. I'm just going to talk about it since... 3DS games for some reason hate me. It's the only it's I can I can do DS games now because of emulation. And I just can't I can't do 3DS games. I just can't do it. I don't know why. I hate it. It annoys me greatly. Are you here yet, dude? Whatever. Forget you. Well actually no, it's midnight now. He's probably there. Does it count? Please tell me it counts. It does count. Awesome. I'm very happy. Alright. Awesome. Cool. Alright. I know we're 12 minutes into this video. I don't know if I can complete the house in time or not. But I'm at least going to start it. I think I might be able to. Anyway. Um, I'll meet you guys back over there, so, peace. <laughs> Alright, I'm back, boys, even though it wasn't any time whatsoever for you guys. Off screen, I grabbed max amount of arrows, well, I bought them, I didn't grab them. As well as, I bought 30 bombs, and that's basically it. Make sure you've got at least, um, up to the hook shot. You definitely need the shot for this. So, just basically do it in the order I'm doing it. Just makes everything easier. Actually, this place, I believe. And remember to do this on the first day. I'm stupid. I did. <laughs> I'm dumb. I am retarded. Let's go into the ocean side spider house. Drop. Bada boom, bada bang. And again, um, I'd actually recommend, I did the Swamp Spider House earlier, but if you want to have an easier time and not, like, have to use, like, beans and stuff, which, in my opinion, it's not a huge deal, but I'm sure some people don't really like doing that. Um, the hookshot makes that so much easier, because you can just grab the skull of, skull of tokens, um, with your, uh, hookshot. So, if you want, you can, I probably shouldn't have bought so many arrows, huh? Eh, whatever. I have infinite, <laughs> I have infinite rupees. Just kidding. Die. And you can't be... Oh yeah, that's right. Dum dum me. Now I can kill you. And just to check. Because why the heck not, right? I think we're good. Alright. We're gonna hookshot onto this thing. And, uh... I'm... Oh, 
Okay, I thought I might have seen something over there. I'm just being very cautious, which I probably shouldn't be, because I am on a time limit. <laughs> Boom. Fire. Fire power. Welcome to the library, the most evil and demented place in the universe. Alrighty. Let's see what we can find. Apparently nothing. You know you found them all as soon as... Oh yeah, I know what to do here. Push. Never mind. Don't push. Pull. What? I think I did this wrong. Maybe. No, I did right. What? What is the point of the other ones? Alright, whatever. <laughs> I don't care, I guess. There we go. That's my fourth one. Wow, I'm doing very good. It's sarcasm. And you're also going to want to have the captain's mascot, or captain's hat. I sort of forgot about that. If you want to get a heart piece, that's in here as well. Because you're not only collecting the 30 sculptures. Huh? Ah, Captain, sir, it's been a long time since we've seen you, as you've had secrets of this place. According to the information I've obtained, it seems Yellow should be shot, shot sixth. Oh my god, how did I forget it? I even told myself in my mind to make sure I had something to write stuff down. Okay. I can fix this. BRB. All right, you fulfilled your duties. Get out of here. So, me being the sly, slick person I am, decided to, uh... do some stuff off camera. So, I... Well, I didn't do, like, anything in the game. I went and got stuff to help me, because I thought I could do this no problem, but it's start. I'm starting to feel like that may not be the case. How do I even get up here? How do I get up onto these things? Is there like a thing I can hook shot up to? Man, I'm really doing very bad. Boom. So I know... Goodness gracious. Climb this. Oh. Anyway, to speak to you. Huh? Ah, Captain, sir, it's been a long time since we've seen you. Yes. No, I didn't hear you. Speak to me again. As you've ordered, sir, we are missing. Yeah, great. Yellow should be shot first. Alright, so yellow's also one. Cool. This is random every single time, as, as far as I know. So... Basically, uh, make sure that you do this correctly. And you also write stuff down, because if you forget and you kill them without doing so, uh, guess what? You're gonna have to replay this whole thing. Because unless you have a good memory, you're kind of screwed. All 
Alright, we're gonna go um, bookshelf hopping. I knew there was one in here. Alright. Sorry if I'm very, like, bad, basically. I'm not very focused right now. Oh, I'm trying to focus, and I'm not doing a very good job. I guess there is one there, I knew it. My timing is absolutely amazing, dude. Wow. That is, like, amazing that I did that badly. Thank goodness. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, um, let me do this, please. As far as I know, there's no more in here. I'm out. Peace. I forget how to kill these guys, actually. Um. Now I know. Come on, game. Come on. The aiming is so good. Thank you. Wow. Alright, we're gonna have to burn this, I'm pretty sure. I'm playing so badly, we're already 21 minutes in, I really wanted to finish this, this episode, it was my goal. I guess you can see which ones to hit, because they're open. Right? Yeah. Nice. any of these open? Well, I can't see, so... Burn. Oh. Why, hello there. Die. Um... There's definitely one up here. Oh boy. That was interesting. There's definitely not one up there, I guess. Oh my gosh, this is really <laughs> something else. What? So I had to do that twice, apparently. Cool. Um, can we destroy these like this? Nice. Are you serious? How am I supposed to do this? What? How am I supposed to kill you, dude? I'm going crazy, everybody. I'm going cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. <laughs> Let's go in this door. Where will this lead me? Oh boy. Alright. Let's talk to you. Huh? Hi, Captain Sir. It's been a long time since we've seen you. As you've ordered, sir. Green should be sought. Okay. Green is a two. I'd like to speak to you. Huh? 
Uh, Captain Sarah, it's been a long time since we've seen you. Blue's fourth. You have fulfilled your duty. Good job, sir. Or, uh, child. I'm guessing red is gonna be one of these. Red is third. So we only have to know which one is fifth. Which could be anyone. But who knows? I don't. Green. Alright. This is easy. So I'm curious if it works if we use the hookshot. So it's yellow. Does not work if we use the hookshot. Alright. Then red. Then blue. Then green. Then yellow. Now, believe it or not, when I first played this game, I did that completely, completely 100% randomly. How? I don't know. But I did it. And here we go, we got a piece of heart. That's pretty cool, isn't it? It's pretty nifty. The thing is, is that There's no scotch loops in here, by the way. I don't know if I have time to finish this or not. Oh, they literally just come back. Never mind. I was... Okay, can you not? I really... Oh my gosh. We're in an Everland... How do I... I can't do it. I can't cancel it. It's an ever-ending loop. Get out of here. Don't, for the life of me, do not press the button again. Oh my gosh. I'm so good at this game, everybody. I'm amazing. How am I going? How did... How am I gonna get that? Huh? No! Now they're all scotchels again. Alright, I think I have to do something else for that. But whatever. Um, I'm using the wrong thing, actually. Really? Oh my gosh. Anyway, that's going to be the end of this episode. I've had about enough of this. I'll record this. Maybe, I'll maybe record another episode or start streaming. Who knows? I'm out. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> oh my goodness.